Hello everyone. Today I wanted to take some time and share my views on the George Floyd incident, which is really a tragedy, I would say. I seen the videos of his death on uh, social media and I have to admit that it was just simply too hard for me to watch. His cries for help because he couldn't breathe are just heartbreaking. I don't understand how anyone could hear his cries and continue to choke him until he died. It's, it's just, I had to fast forward the video because I couldn't watch it. The replays are all over social media, so it's just impossible to miss. I believe the officer um, involved is, has been arrested and only time will tell if justice will prevail in this case. There seems to be a lot of hatred towards the black community in the United States, uh, which is very unfortunate and racism is a hot topic all around the world. I haven't traveled to the States in many years and things like this really make me uneasy uh, and worried to travel there. I still have lots of family members still living in the States. They're men and I wouldn't want to hear anything like that happening to them. Things like that shouldn't happen to anybody. It has been said that one of the ways for black people in the States to, you know, like avoid the senseless acts of violence towards them is to build wealth. Um, I don't want to get into politics. It's not my field of expertise. But if there is any truth to that, then black people should definitely pull together and start making smart money moves. I mean, you do see white people go into schools and shoot up children and they are not treated this way. And so I can only pray that justice will prevail in this case for George Floyd and his family. Now, why am I even talking about this since I focus on health and beauty on my channel? If you follow me, uh, you'll know that I promote Black is Beautiful movement. And when I decided to embark on this journey to build my brand, I did a lot of research on the Black community and how the cosmetic world has approached uh, the topic of uh, dark skin. And I would read comments such as uh, black women don't wear makeup and this is why we didn't think of them when we were building the brand and so on and so forth. And first of all, this is why a lot of brands were not inclusive. And another thing I, 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 I found out is like a lot of the products that are directed at black people are just plain highly toxic. Um, Two examples, skin lightening um, products to make our dark skin lighter, as long, along with um, hair relaxers that we, we use to make our hair look straighter. Well, if you think about it, like the hairdresser will apply these uh, harsh chemical strong products to your scalp, directly to your scalp, while they are protecting their hands with gloves. So that should say something. These products are highly toxic and they will mess up your health and mess up your reproductive system. Same thing with the skin lightening products because both of these products have to be uh, used continuously. The hair relaxer, you have to add to your hair every other month and you do that for years to come. And the skin lightening products, if you, don't, if you stop using them, <laughs> your skin color will go back to being dark and those two things are very very toxic and over time they wreak havoc on our health and make us sick and and we continue to to go towards these products because a lot of times we we just don't know better like but in my research i felt like seriously disheartened by all that i've learned and then you go to your doctor and your doctor will tell you, well, this particular problem, you know, is very common 
amongst black women this particular health issue and so on and so forth and then i would sit there and wonder why but it all makes sense now after the research that i've that i've done why we get certain sickness but did you know that science supports that dark skin is strong skin i mean the melanin content in our skin that melanin that makes our skin dark is a natural protection against ultraviolet radiation that cause cancer and another cool thing about black people is that we are born with the bones that are dense around the face and so that means that black faces maintain structural support for a longer period of time and so our skin looks younger longer on that black don't crack on that level black don't crack black is beautiful so history has shown us that for whatever reason we've been conditioned to believe that we are less than people because of our color because of our hair well that's not true we are beautiful and we are enough and so whoever and and by whomever these standards of beauty was built to make us feel unpretty well they're wrong and let's not let anybody tell us or convince us any thing else that we are beautiful and we are strong so what happened to george floyd is wrong and a lot of people are speaking out about it and taking to the streets hopefully that will move things enough to seek justice for this man and his family and i just hope that no more people get hurt in the process it has been said we all know the saying don't hate me because I'm beautiful. Where to that, I add, don't hate me because I'm black. So those were my thoughts on this whole situation. I'll say goodbye for now.